Welcome back! Hello! Uh, I'm going this way. This is not the way I'm supposed to go, but I saw this over here and was like, well, we'll go do this. Yeah, we're exploring. We're, we're the Lewis and Clark of Final Fantasy. Oh, it's just over here. It's this thing, it's this thing that I saw earlier. It was like, hey, there's two chests over there. Oh. Thank you for the recovery ring. And thank you for the return sphere. That's a good sphere to have. Yeah, because there are like eight different types of spheres. Well, that the return sphere lets you return back to any place you've been to on the sphere grid. Oh. So that way you I, don't have to move. You don't up. have to move all the way back. You yeah. can you can jump to another place if you want to send somebody down another path. Nice. That is a good sphere. It's almost as good as the friend sphere. Oh. The friend sphere lets you jump to somebody else's place on the on the sphere grid. Seriously? Yes. Oh, I thought you were just, you know, like, being waxing and being nice. No. Nope. It's like, but you know what else is good? Friendship. Friendship. <laughs> Screw friendship. <laughs> no, I'm talking like a legit friend sphere. It, it, it actually helps oh. me a lot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Like, what good is friendship here? Ah, right away. You have tools. Tools that get you where you need to go. That's right. That's really what friends are. They just have things that you want that'll help you, so you just, you know, you're nice to them. Yeah. Many, many a pessimist has uh, said, you know, that's what friends are. Yep. They'll be upon us soon. The she has sent fiends to test our summoner's strength. She? Yep. Who is she? Thank you, Yuna. Yuna Leska. Yep. In exactly how many people are supposed to be dead here? Everybody. As much as Micah and Seymour. Say. Oh. I see. Lost your nerve. No. Okay. Nothing frightens I her. thought she, she no, she she gives them the final summoning. Oh, okay. So that's why she's alive because she did the first one. So she's got to be there to. She knows she's the one who knows how to do it. Okay. That's where they've been trapped. You have to get all the aeons, and then you have to uh, prove to her you're worthy. Her. Of yep. Her. Okay. I was about to say it's like, are you telling me that the woman that they all revere for you know being the first one to uh, get the final aeon, she isn't sent either? And she's supposed to be dead, but she's breaking the rules anyway. No, well, she's breaking the oh. rules, but she has to break the rules so you can get so they can defeat Sin. Yeah, it's not okay. like she's just breaking the rules just to freaking break. Yeah, the rules. yeah. I thought she was pulling a Seymour I, and just like, uh, oh, I'm back. I'm changing my formation. I want Yuna and I want Kimori. Okay, that I can accept. Save. That's well, like if you're telling me that there is one more person in this freaking world. Who has died, but then just said, nope, not for me. Um, you're gonna get really angry then here in a little bit. Oh, good lord. Like, really angry in a little bit. Oh, gosh. Run away! Surprise! No one dies here. I don't know why I'm skipping all these fights, because this boss fight's hard as fuck, too. Oh. Did this... The... Okay, you remember that giant purple dude that you thought was really cool when you were mesmerized by? Yes. Okay. Oh, I think we found uh, it's his a bigger big, dude, I, Yeah, I think we found his big brother. Yep, that would be the behemoth. Oh, my. Um. Hi, handsome. Hi, everybody. Uh, we're going to black magic, and we're going to. You're just a cuddly little thing. Hello, friend. We're going to do this. Um. Kimari, I need you to use your overdrive. We're gonna go, uh... About to say, Mighty Guard! About to say, can, can we pull a, um... Undertale and talk him down? <laughs> like, pacifist playthrough? <laughs> no. No. You can't do that. There we go. Let's do a regular spiral cut. Bam. Woo! Alright. Um... Add a little sum sum on the end. I think this Orin does. Well, he looks armored. 
Uh, let's grand summon. Let's grand summon one I didn't use my things on. So, Malifor, come on, buddy. Yeah. I let's... know you don't do a lot of damage, but we're... Uh, hey, laser him. See what happens. First and best right here. Eh, he's not the best. No, no, no. He's, best. Best. he's yeah. the only one that does have two overdrives, though, which is kind of yeah. cool. Which I can't get till later, but that's okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, Valifor was uh, the first. Yes, yeah, so he was uh, your first one. Got. Yes. He's not necessarily the first one either, depending on where you start your your journey at. Yeah, that makes sense. If you start your journey in Bavel, you get Bahamut first. Yeah, that makes sense. Hello, Photon Wings. Uh, oh, that's cool. I can't hate you now. I'm also zombified now. You see that? So I can't yeah. heal myself. Go ahead. That's fine. Yeah. That's fine. Yeah. Oh, would you waste all your turns? That's good. I'm okay with that. Yeah, you, you do your thing. Valifor understands. We Not have like... we have like dinner later to make up for yeah. all this. Ha! 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 I'm sorry. Oh, I hit him too many times. I hit him too many times. Oh, tail sweep. Uh, I'm going to use Ixion Go because you have Overdrive. Yeah. Spam the hell out of this. That was one of the bad things about this game is if you, all you have to do is really level up Yuna. She's the only one you really got to do. So her uh, Aeons get stronger? Yeah, her Aeons get stronger. She gets stronger. And then you can use your items to upgrade your Aeons. So if I really wanted to, if I just grinded like hell and kept stealing a bunch of stuff, I could just make the Aeons so strong, I just have to use Yuna the whole you, time. You could just, you could just overpower yes. the crap out of yeah. That is wonderful. And then, like I said, her, her last weapon makes it makes all, all her spells cost one MP to use, doesn't matter what they are. So, you really don't need anybody else but Yuna. Wow. But, it, but you gotta put some effort into it. Yes. So, I like it. It's, it's kind of an alternative. Like, depending on how you might want to... Oh. Haha, ha, that's what you get. You didn't kill me. Oh, shit. I don't have Reflect. You. I don't have Reflect. Bastard. Son of a... You have the Star Curtain. You were right. Can I use it here? I can't use it while he's in the game. Okay, alright. Uh, here's what we'll do. Like, you just totally undid Thor's does, hammer. Yeah. You a-hole. Double Thor's hammer. Because, yeah. because, uh, if, because, uh, what's-his-face did, uh, 9,999. He did it twice. Yeah. Uh, Ifrit. Yeah, if, no, uh, Valifor. Uh, Valifor, yeah. Kill me, oh. please. Oh. All right. I can't oh. do it! Because of zombie. Because of the thing. Ah, oh, ha, 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 you mother. All right, that's fine. Let's do this. Sneaky son of a Let's do it. Bring it. Go ahead, help me kill me. Ah ha! Ah, that's what you get. <laughs> ha! Take, take more. Yeah, take my horn. It's cool. You, you pull your, you know, magic, alchemy circle thing. All right. So the question is, can I use Star Curtain here? I cannot. It has to be Riku who uses it. Oh. Or Kimori. So. I have to go use. But use. On you. Thank you. Oh. Now he's going to play. All right. Cool. Okay, what, explain what just happened. He put Reflect on Kimori. So, when he casts Kuriga, he's not going to cast it at himself because he's got Reflect on him. He's going to cast it at Kimori to bounce it off Kimori to hit him. Yeah, I'm telling you. This... He loopholed it. Yes. Yes. Yes, he did. You know, come on what back. What the hell? I'm telling you, man. I'm telling you. This is, uh... I told you, shit gets hard. It's... Oh my gosh. I seriously underestimated this. The next fight, the same boss does the same thing. Like, it counteracts what you do, so you have to... Ca it's like a giant chess game. It is... 
Oh, that is amazing. Yeah. So it's always wow. so, so, so it's not just a basic strategy. Is it's a strategy you have to counter. You have to change your strategy through the fight. Wow, it, it really does become a counter uh, game. Yeah. If you're not careful. That's fine, Tail Sweep. I'm good. Ah, you missed. Oh, uh, yeah. You try to hit our Ice Queen. That's right. Wow. I... So, 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 yeah, so it's interesting. So, like, if I actually had the spell, which I don't think I do yet, like, like I would I'd beef up all my people, and he'd put Reflect on them, and I couldn't dispel because it bounced off. And, I mean, it's it's a... It's a cluster. Yeah, it it really is kind of like a chess game. You have to... You have to think ahead for everything. Yep. So he reflected, and he photon winged. But, so. Yeah, but this is this is kind of like the thing with turn-based uh, combat mm -hmm. like this, is that it allows for stuff like this. So I need to dismiss you because you have reflect on you. Ha! Hit him! Hit him! Punch him in the face. There you go. No. Bad thing. You said you said this was a behemoth. Yeah. Bad behemoth. What do I want to? Uh, I can't use black magic, so Oren, go. All right, guys, it's time to go back to the tried and true method. Hit it till it dies. Will haste to go work? I didn't think so. Fucking mother of God. Alright. The the reflect take all the haste to go to yeah, him? Yeah, it took the haste to go to him. I, I screwed the pooch on that one. Wait, wait. So the reflect actually stops all yep. magic? Yep, it does. Oh, I thought it would only nope. affect nope. attack magic. Sorry, everyone, if we keep kind of going in and out on this. Yeah, because I'm, uh, like, I'm, I've got to think. Yeah, I'm enthralled here. I got to think. All right, hold on. Do you? Does that work? Does not. Okay. I delay. You know, this actually, like, it reminds me of like old school Yu-Gi-Oh episodes. Where I would just sit and wonder what's, what they're going to do next. What's going on next? And yeah. Well, I guess I have to. Wow. Okay. You've just thought of something. No, no, I just, I forgot that that if you do that to, oh shit. Okay. But yeah, the um, the kind of old school Yu-Gi-Oh episodes that I'd watch, where I would just like sit and go, okay, and they would actually. That is one of the things like I never fully understood in Yu-Gi-Oh is that they always explain what every move does. Yeah. Uh, even though they're supposed to be, like, world-class duelists, it's like, I know what it freaking does. <laughs> it's like, I play this card you've seen 800 times, times. but I'm going to explain to you what it does. Well, that's, that's all about the marketing there, what that was about. I mean, you know, there were... Yeah, and it's so that if, it, if it's, like, someone's first episode watching it, they, they're always caught up with what's yeah. happening. Yeah. They're, they're never fully out of the loop. But, yeah, I, um... I actually thought it was, like, a rule for a while that you, that they had to explain <laughs> what they were doing. I was like, huh, what an interesting rule for a strategy game. Well, again... Explaining it's... everything you're doing. Well, and again, they think we're stupid, so they had to explain it every time for... Yeah. Does this work? you get delayed if I do this? Oh, shut your face. 
Shut your face! It... Are, are we spamming? Uh, we're spamming the hell out of this. Until it doesn't work anymore, I'm doing it. All right. All right. Good job, boss. Welcome to the spam show. Yeah! Cheat the system. Oh, I need to do it. Let's see, I'm doing 800 damage per one I'm doing. You bastard. Dick! That is a powerful cure. It's a cure guy, yeah. Yeah, I, I don't even fully remember when I got it when I was playing Kingdom Hearts, but I got it all of a sudden I could cure my entire party. I'm like, I'll take this. Yeah. Yeah, I accept this. Asshole. All right, and I can't heal myself. I can't cast it at me, so I'll cast it at you to get it cast back at me. Yeah. This would go so much better if I had the spell. To take down his reflect? Yeah. Ha! But yeah, th when I would watch Old School Yu-Gi-Oh, I, I would be like, sometimes I would be like really thankful that they had the cheerleader characters on the sidelines. Yeah. Who would explain stuff like uh, like you have to do with me sometimes. Like, oh no. He's had to bounce it back off himself. What does that mean? It means he's screwed. <laughs> I think that's why like, I really liked the Abridged series. Because... Yeah. They would kind of do what I was always hoping they'd do, of just explaining um, what would happen, but talk about it very sensically. <laughs> just like, what does that mean? It means he's screwed. I'm gonna try something crazy. Okay. We're going to try to poison ourselves so it bounces off to him. That's not a bad idea, actually. Okay, that did not work. What? You gave me a fantastic idea. No. That's who I wanted to throw it at. Ha ha! Loopholes! You're a genius! You are a genius. <laughs> Alright, you want to play rough? Let's play rough. Uh, no. The only one that doesn't have... Yes, I know, it's a long episode, everybody. It's okay, because this is, this is, this is a, this is Thunderdome There's right th now. Yeah, and... And plus, I have a feeling if I don't beat it, I'm going to have to grind a little bit more. So it's not going to be as fun. Yeah. We're trying to hold off for you. Here we go. Let's see. Here. Yeah, we're, we're, try, we're trying to see how this ends. We don't want to leave you hanging and then just have like a four minute episode next time. Look at his health. He's back to full health. Yeah. You know what? Maybe it is a good time to call it an episode since he's at full health. And let me think for a minute. Okay. How's that sound, everybody? All right. All right. So we'll leave it here. And we'll come back, and you'll probably watch me die in five minutes and be super angry. So, uh, we'll see you guys next time. Till next time.